Hello, everybody. I'm going to get a better lighting. There you go. All right, it's Dr. Zinger for 15 minute fuel, which is in 15 minutes a day will feed your mind, your body, and your future. This will be a short one today, but this is our 100th episode of 15 minute fuels in 100 days. So thank you so much for you guys' support and everything we do. Make sure you subscribe to all our, our YouTubes, Instagrams, Twitter, Facebook, uh, the fan page of Dr. Zeno. And don't forget, we're on SoundCloud, Stitcher, and iTunes. Get on board those things for all the great things we're doing. So, okay, let's talk about uh, the update. So, how'd it go last night? Everything went great. Uh, you know, I went to the finals and the speakers event. And you had five minutes. And I practiced my talk and it never went over five minutes but i guess when i when i was on stage and when you're on stage and you're feeding off people in the moment you know my pauses were longer it was just a little bit more deep and connecting and i ran out of time i mean i was it was i was like 10 seconds before my close so i needed like another 10 seconds but i ran out so i got disqualified but you know the impact was made and you know you had 21 uh, or 20 21 meeting uh meeting planners there so you know, not not winning the event didn't mean I didn't win uh, the stages and and the uh, the respect and admiration of people over there. So it was really good time and a good. It was great. Uh, had a lot of fun. You'll see in the episodes. Um, it was good. So today was just more seminar. So today we we learned about taking your message to the stages. You know, and how do you do that? And then scale. You know, how do you take that message out and scale it? So yeah, hundred episodes are great. So thank you guys for being on. So let's go over the one hundred. Uh, Kind of things that happened over the last hundred days. It's a hundred days, right? Hundred episode, hundred days. So, one hundred days, we went from this hero concept. We started talking about that. So, we actually used the fifteen minute fuels to kind of just hash out like these concepts that are just coming to mind. Just these, you know, the all the different ones, such as grieving your potential, being a uh, not a perfectionist, being a potentialist. You know, talking about you know the pride, the ego, and the humility. The uh, you know, all the amazing things, the embracing the hero mindset, the maximizing your superpowers and the choosing the vehicle of your truth to serve the world. So all these different concepts we went over on the 15 minute fuels to develop this, uh, this whole entire hero journey. And through the, we are heroes, you got to see the documentation of these things coming to pass and really making out. So hundred days, is not a long time. So let's take a moment now just to take a deep breath and celebrate and appreciate the last hundred days, meaning that in only a hundred days, all this to happen where, you know, now I'm meeting with meeting planners on the big stages and it's all these things came, all these opportunities came because you had a, you had a, I had an idea, right? I had this, this journey, this, this moment, like we all have moments in our lives. And then I decided to, I had to, for me, I had to take uh, action on the moment, had to, because that was that grieving your potential. And then I started moving. And then here's the thing, because, well, the great thing we documented it is because, because we don't like, when we know we should do something, we don't do it because we're not clear of the future. We have uncertainty. Well, what's, what's the next idea going to look like? What's the business going to look like? What happens if I do this? We worry about what we're going to lose, not what we're going to gain, right? We don't look at what we're going to gain, look at what we're going to lose. And so not having that clear picture keeps us stuck in where we're at. And so I said, well, with the help of you guys, you know, I didn't feel alone because when you have people and support, it's easier to start moving forward, right? You're not alone. So we started moving forward. And as we moved forward, not even, even though we didn't have a clear end goal, we embraced the unknown. So the first thing is we knew we had a, this hero message. Great. Boom. Check. At least, so that's why you want to be a potentialist, right? So do the best you can with what you got in the moment you have it. So at least I know I had the hero, uh, some type, type of hero message, the substance of that. We knew the 15 minute fuels were doing great. We had the camera team to document the journey because we knew it would be good. And then along the way, you know, you seek out, let's build this hero keynote. So building the hero keynote basically came from the feedback that we did on the 15 minute fuels, right? Going back and forth. These are the things that you got, your comments. We just kind of pulled it together. So this is why it's, it's your support was amazing. And then um, worked with Roberto. We started building the keynote just to build it. And then we found out from Garrett Gunnarsson, hey, you got a keynote in two weeks. So that was the first time we got to do a 20 minute keynote and it went really good. And then uh, Garrett introduced me to so-and-so and, -so, and then, uh, Dr. Isaac Jones introduced me to this, this person. And, and then we're here in Colorado Springs. And I got to uh, do a three minute and a five minute keynote. 
and uh, get in front of people who put you on stages, which is great because that's ultimately where you want to go. So you see, even though there's all these unknowns, we just went ahead and started doing it anyway. So like I always said, you know, the whole hero message in my keynote is basically what I'm doing right now as we're living. It's the craziest thing. It's not like I'm telling people from experience. The talk is actually in the present time experience, just like the 15 minute fuels. So we embrace the hero mindset. We said, you know what? I am the hero. We are the heroes. You know, we can be proud and have pleasure and satisfaction and we could have uh, of our achievements. We can be proud and have pleasure and satisfaction of the gifts we've been given and those around us doing well. And we can have the confidence in ourselves and, the, and, and, the, and, the, and we can see the self-importance of our message to be able to take it out and help people and serve the world. We could be selfish and unselfish. We could have the humility, the pride and the ego all at the same time. And then we went forward. We start doing the 15 minute fuels in the videos and you get to see all these things, how, how they how they come about. So it's been really a great journey. And along the journey, you know, you pick a time like 100 days. I think that was great. 100 days in, we could take a time and we celebrate. You know, we just say, hey, look, look at what we've done in 100 days to help give you the blueprint that, hey, you see, it, it doesn't take that long. You just got to do something every day about it. So that's why, you know, video was my media or what we're doing now. Uh, so if writing's your media, if singing's your media, if if radio's your media, or podcasting, whatever that vehicle of influence to get your story out, start doing it daily, and look all look at what happened when, in just 100 days. That's not a long time for you. Just imagine if you started writing for 100 days in a row and getting blog posts out. There will be so many amazing unknowns and opportunities that happen that it'll change everything, and you'll be so glad you did it. Now, for those of you that started with us 100 days ago and nothing really changed in your life, what happens is you, you find yourself 100 days later in the same position because you, you wanted things to be perfect. You wanted things to be 100%. You wanted to know exactly where the map was going to take you. But the problem is you find yourself 100 days later with nothing. And so if I said, would you take 50 50% over nothing, and you would say, yes, I would. See, so that's why you don't want to be perfect. If, even if you knew 50% or got 50% of the results, it would be a lot better than zero, right? Zero does nothing and does nothing to serve the world. And so that's why start doing something today. This is just 100 days. We'll revisit a kind of a time like this at 200 days and then one year, and you'll really get to see how just moving forward, despite not having a clear, a clear goal or a clear, this is, how's this thing going to pan out? You just enjoy the ride. And uh, for me, and the ride could be different things. So it could be um, parts that give you, uh, of the journey that give you validation, right? So for me, if you heard yesterday, I didn't get that email saying that I made it to the finals. So it was tough because I really, this is such a good message. And you guys, we all responded well to it. And, uh, but I said, well, maybe the meeting planners aren't looking for this message. And so I had to understand the market. So whatever we do in life, the market decides if it succeeds or not. You could have a great video or a great song, but if no one wants to listen to it, if they don't like it, it doesn't work for, it doesn't get you anywhere. So, but it was nice that they just forgot to send the email. So, hey, look, so I made it to the final. So at least it gave me a little bit of um, validation that, okay, it is it is a message they like. And then after last night, you know, if, if, the, if the timer didn't run, run out, I probably could have won it. Which didn't matter. I mean, everybody won who made it. It was like a kind of an American Idol syndrome thing, right? You know, it doesn't matter. The finalists are the finalists. They're all great. But the feedback from meeting planners that have seen thousands of speakers and put people on stage for thousands of people, just to get them, just to see them be engaged. Because just think, you know, they've seen it all. They've seen the top Seth Godin's and and, and all the speakers, the Anthony Robbins. So for them to have even have a reaction and not be numb and to have really good things to say because they were supposed to critique you too. So one of my critiques was um, when I'm talking on stage, there's a when you look at a timeline, if you're looking at the stage, the timeline, right? The early days would be to the left. Of the, like if I'm looking at the stage, early, early in the life would be left and then to the right of the stage would be later in life. So I do it the opposite. Right, so I would walk to my left. No, I would walk to my right at which you know, so they just a simple thing like that, right? So maybe switch left to right. I mean that I mean that's what they gave me. So um I'll take it. <laughs> I'll practice that. Uh so it was really cool. And it gave me see this journey, this this event today or this weekend gave me all I needed was the slight one percent validation 
from the marketplace and the market share to say, listen, this message is powerful. We're at the edge of our seats. We want this. This is talking to me. And that was the, the validation of, and really verification, should I say, that the message is wanted by the market as well in the world. Like we knew it was, but you got to test it. So that was, see, so even this was all worth it. Just that you go to one event for three days and all you need is that one thing. And that just that one little turn now opens up a whole new way of your confidence and your willingness to push forward hard. So and thank you guys for the reason why I give you an update on this is because we, we really built this together. Yeah, it was my message, but you know, these 15 minutes, a hundred days of 15 minute fuels and your feedbacks and what you like the best, we were able to kind of make this hero keynote come alive and really touch the hearts of so many people. So I'm thankful for you guys for doing that. Uh, so the agenda tonight, we're going to go back to a reception and, and network and get to meet uh, different people. And that this is where the unknowns happen, right? You know, you know, I met, we met a couple different people this week and you get introduced to people and some, some you, you, you gel with, some you got nothing in common with. And, but the, the new relationships or friendships or acquaintances that are met lead to other opportunities and doors being open and then more unknowns happen. So all the genius, the greatness, the stories and the opportunities in the unknowns. So my, uh, my appreciation, my gift to you guys today would be like, if the last hundred days you're still thinking about it, Let's start tomorrow, or let's start now, write that thing, speak that thing, video that thing, or do a podcast on that thing, whatever, whatever you do, whatever your vehicle is, just start doing it. Don't even worry how it's gonna pay the bills, right? If you just do it, you're gonna feel better about yourself, you'll have more energy, right? I mean, you'll, you'll be so excited because you're doing something you love. Just start doing it, post it for the world, post it on social media, or the social media site that, that covers that vehicle, and get it out to the world. Start getting that following because the following is going to give you feedback so you can start sculpting your message. You're not going to sculpt your message sitting in your room thinking about it, but you will sculpt your message when you get a chance to talk to seven people, 7,000 people and get their feedbacks and their feedback makes you think of things differently. You get to mold this beautiful masterpiece. So you're going to have to do it with the help of others. So that's why don't be insecure. Just get your message out there and enjoy and be grateful for the feedback, pros and cons to help develop your masterpiece. And then once you have your masterpiece, now you have your voice and you find your vehicle and that vehicle becomes your voice to give it out to the world. So have an amazing day. Um, tomorrow, we'll be going to the airport. I'll, I'll, we'll, we'll, we'll get it done. I'll totally get it done tomorrow uh, for the 15 minute fuel. Have an amazing day. And uh, thank you guys for all you've done. This is 100 days of many, many more. God bless, we'll see you soon.